everybody, my name is Gwen. Today we are reading Peppa Pig's book. It's called A Trip to the Moon. Ooh, I really want to try, but I am too little. But and I doesn't have much money to go on. It is a lovely sunny day. Peppa is playing with her fancy ball. George and his friend Edmund elephants are playing with their space toys. Moon, moon. George is pretending the fancy ball is on the moon. Wait, why do this moon are very small, and you? And it looked like a a potato. It just like a it just like a small small planet called Pluto. And I remember in mm, some some small planets like Pluto can be look like a potato like this. It called a uh, um. Mm, Make make. Um, I couldn't remember though. Let me read some more. I was playing with that ball. Oh, Edmund space toy has landed on Papa's head. <laughs> Too funny. I think an astronaut want to land on the Earth will go. In this one, a land on Peppa Pig, like the monster pig, but she's not a monster pig. She, she's a cute little piggy. This look fun. Are you going to the moon? It is just boring space stuff for babies study. It's not real. Peppa, did you know? Why do we get the night? I think she didn't know, and I has no. She just four years old, and George has two years old. I know that. But space is real, Peppa, and there are real rockets that go on the moon. And I said for you, when the space is not real. We cannot get the day and the night though, and and when it has not space in in the real, it's not real like Peppa says. It is just boring stay say space stuff for baby study. It's not real. When it were not real, where can we live on? I remember I has read a book name is Goldilocks Planet. It say Earth is everybody home, even animals home too. It's everybody. Animals even people live on here. Okay. Hmm. Uh. A museum has show all about the moon. Shall we go and see it? Yeah. Will we really have to go to the moon? No, Peppa. We're not going to the moon. Just pretend. We're going to the museum. Okay. Here is the museum. Hello, everyone. Have you come to see the moon show? Yes, Miss Rabbit. Five ticket, please. There you are. Enjoy your trip to the moon. Oh, we really are going to the moon. No, Peppa. I just pretend. This way for our ship to the moon. Mister Rabbit. As the tour guide, 
prepare to take off. Is it just pretend, is it? That's right, Peppa. I just pretend. When it real, this rocket do not be like a train like this. And everybody need to wear a their their suit just like him. But we need to have a backpack at at here at our pack at our back. And in that backpack, it have a gas we can breathe like oxygen. When we don't have oxygen, how can we breathe in the space? Okay, let's continue with it. Five, four, three, two, one, blast off! Ooh, blast off! They make the wall is black and put on some dots. Just like the space when I see, no, the night skies, I see a lot of stars. There are thousands or millions of stars. There are too many for two counts. Mm. We live on a planet. Does anyone know what is it called? The Earth. That's right. I am a bit of expert at the space things. There are seven of other planets that go around our sun. Does everyone know what that they're, they're called? I know it. You can't look at here. You can look, but I will not. I will say it for you. Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Neptune, Uranus, and some more smaller planets. Oh, it's the same. But she's... No, but Edmund say a little bit of mixing. Mercury? Oh, well done, Edmund. Venus, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Neptune, Uranus. Uh, ah, she, she, he said just like me. <laughs> Sorry. Edmund knows all about the space. I am a clever. Does anyone know what these planets are made of? They're made of cardboard. But just pretend. Mm, these models are made of cardboard. But the real planets are made of rock and ice and gas. Of course. Venus, mm, Mercury and Earth or the rock planets. And you know, the difference is the sun is not a planet. No, it's not. The sun is a big star of burning gas. And, and the giant planet is hmm, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. They're all made from gas, not rock like us. And, and Saturn have a ring. It was a beautiful ring around that planet. And Uranus have it too. But, but this kind of look like Saturn. When we turn this around, now we can call Uranus. Some scientists think some some planets are are bumped into Nep Neptune no Uranus and then 
that rain is turned into this, and it always go round and round like this, not go round and round like that. And the ring are made of dust, rock, and ice. I all know that. Hmm. But of course, the moon is made from of cheese. What? It made from cheese? So the astronaut comes on, smell some cheese. <gasps> then they put up a spoon and scoop, scoop, scoop. Then put down the earth with a lot, thousand bags of of moon. And some more days, no one see. Some more years, no one see the moon. And the astronaut says, the moon is made from cheese, and we, and we put in this bag. <laughs> so funny, isn't? But I think the moon is will not made from cheese. It must be made from rock. Mm. No, the moon is made from rock. No, it. I didn't read this yet. And this is a serious tower, so no jokes and no giggling. Here we are on the moon. Really? Wait, are we cutting the head of the moon? No, we just building some. Wait, we're on the moon. Why do we have two moons? This is one of the moon, and this is another moon. What? I don't know anything about the space now. When I see two moons, I will ask. Hmm. Someone put another moon made from cheese. Mm. It's a pretend moon, really, isn't? It? Yes. If this was the real moon, you could jump over my head. Yes. Mm. The moon does not like gravity like us. You see, when you drop something, it must be down. That means gravity pulls it down. And on the moon, you drop something, it flew away. It doesn't fall down like on the earth because in, on the moon, it doesn't have any gravity or, or you you can land down because because it not all no gravity. It just have less gravity more than Earth. Okay. Mm. Does anyone know why we can jump so high on the moon? Gravity. Oh, that's right, Ellen. Gravity is. What keeps us on the ground? It is weaker on the moon, so you can jump higher. We can make you feel like you are jumping on the moon with a help of science. What sound? That sound impressive. How do you do that? With big rubber band. <laughs> so. When anyone fall down, the rubber will fall down, will stretch, then we pull them up, up, down, up, down, very fun. And I want to try too. Everyone is scrapping to Mr. Rabbit anti-gravity rubber stand. Bouncing on the pretend moon is fun. Say, moon cheese. Moo cheese, and that's the end of the tower. Please walk this way. There's, are there trees on the moon? No. 
Are there any castles on the moon? No. Are there any moon shops? No. That would be silly. Yeah. And on the moon, it's very cold. It cannot be warm like here. And on the moon, it has no living things on. When non-living things on, it lives. It never died on the moon because that was living thing. And no, non-living thing. And non-living thing never live. Like this is a non-living thing. It's when I stay from years later, it still exists. But I am a living thing. Years later, I will grow up. I tar some more, and my old goes up. You know it? Mm. Um. Welcome to a moon shop. We've got moon maps, moon books, and everything about the moon and rockets. <laughs> I just added some words. We even got a picture of piggies on the moon with an elephant. <laughs> Some piggies on the moon with an elephant. Look, there we are jumping on the moon. We got moon rock too. It got a picture of a moon all the way through middle. Ooh. How about some real moon cheese? How much is it, Miss Rabbit? Five pounds, please. Five pounds? It all will get cause. Mm, I like the moon now because it's very interesting. Mmm, and very tasty. The moon cannot eat. Daddy Pig? Can you eat the rock? Whoa, look at these pictures. Now I can see on in the moon shops. It has many things look so interesting. So that's the end of this book. Now let's summary. Today, Pe Peppa is playing her fancy yellow ball. George and Edmund are playing the moon's um, space toys. George is pretending Peppa's bouncy ball into a moon. And Edmund's space toy is landed on Peppa's Peppa look angry a bit. Then Daddy Pig sees. Daddy Pig says, Does this look fun? Mommy Pig says, We can go to a museum. It shows everything about the moon. Then when they go to the moon, no, when they go to, to the museum, then, uh, first of all, they need to take the tickets. And then, Mr. Rabbit shows them where to go. They go on a rocket train and go. He asks some questions. Mm. Then, Edmund mm, is, is all answered. First, she says, Earth. Then, she says, Seven, seven plan, seven planets on is Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Neptune, and Uranus. And then she says gravity. And then they they all go to 
The Pretending Moon. Mr. Rabbit says, "You can." When this is a real moon, you can jump higher over my head. The Downy Pig asks him, "How can we jump over?" Well, how can we jump? I like that. Then he says, "With our big rubber band." Then you all jump and jump and jump, bouncy, but their but their feet do not land on the ground.、Mm. And then it was the end of it. Play on the moon. And then they go to the moon shops. It has everything about the moon and space. Then she says, "How about a moon cheese?" Then he, Daddy Pig, buy with five pounds. Then Peppa says, "I love the moon now because it's interesting and tasty," said Daddy Pig.